Yeah, so this is our new LS power steering pump, and this is our old one. So we read online that you can take these nut out. Um, this is where your pressure line goes into it. It goes into those threads. Yep. This this part actually threads into the power steering pump, though. It's where the piston and spring is. So we got the we got them both out here. We're gonna try to put this one inside here. And it was a one inch socket. This might be tricky to get back in. But this way you can use the factory hose because uh, otherwise you're gonna have to have one custom made because you're gonna be going from metric to standard, metric right here to a standard uh, steering box. Got it? Okay. I'm wondering if it's the same threads. Screwing up a brand new water pump. That's like something we do. People online said it would work. It's their fault. Dude, I can't see the O-ring anymore, so. I feel like you got it. Yeah. Are you recording? Yeah, it's over. Recording. Oh, oh yeah. Dude. Wow. Okay. You can take this back, back it up a little bit. <laughs> dude, they want, want All right. We can crank on it on the truck too, probably. All right. So, as you can see, it worked. You said to throw that back in there was a pain, so I was using this in this wrench to apply some pressure on there the socket is just going to sink down in there so that ain't going to work so anyways that's probably the easiest way you can uh swap the power steering lines otherwise you're gonna have to get some custom made or you're gonna have to adapt the old pump or use a later model uh steering gear so and that costs a lot more than just switching out this plug so all right guys that wraps up this video thanks for watching if you guys liked it go ahead and hit that like button if you want to see more content on this truck or any of my other cars subscribe i'll try to keep some videos coming and have a good day thanks